Today is the one year moment that we recognize. It's a somber day. A year ago on March 10th, Michigan detected our first cases of COVID-19. The year since has been equal parts historic and heartbreaking with our fair share of horrors and heroism. Now, to remember those we have lost, I have a request. Tonight, from eight to nine, I ask Michiganders to turn on your porch lights, to light up our streets in memory of those we have lost. So statewide, test positivity has actually increased to 4.1%, up from 3.4% uh, three and a half weeks ago. The case rate is now at 114 cases per million and has also increased over the past three weeks. We are also starting to see a slight increase in our hospitalizations and a little over 4% of inpatient beds are being used to take care of patients who have COVID-19. We are also identifying more and more of the new variants. We've already identified over 500 cases of the more easily transmitted B117 variant. And two days ago, we identified the first known case of uh, a person who was infected by the B1351 variant. About 21% of people over the age of 16 have had at least one dose of the vaccine. And we are getting more and more vaccines into the state every week. And I'm proud of the progress we are making to equitably vaccinate Michiganders and confident we will reach our goal of administering shots to 70% of people ages 16 and up. 